simple vlog guide. There we go. And this is a couple uploads I did right there. LV is so random. I know it's been a little while. I always thought off like this. Today we're gonna escape. I know it's been a while since I did a vlog. Whoa. I am skateboarding to this uh field that is pretty big and area wise i would say well, how y'all doing now y'all having a good day y'all having a okay day day not going too well well i hope i heard the responses of a good day an okay day more than a bad day responses if you're having a bad day, there's a little garden over here. If you're having a bad day, always remember, some storms may be longer than other storms, but all storms are temporary. There's always, uh, usually there's a beautiful result after a storm. They say that when something good is coming, everything starts to crumble. How am I going to stop? I'm going to run off my skateboard. <laughs> oh, this hill is too steep. Stop flipping fall. But the topic that I want to get into today is the definition of reaction. What is a reaction? What do people define a reaction as? Well, many people may not know the exact definition of reaction. In fact, let me look it up right now. Okay. <clears throat> Here's... Whoa, what is that a B? Ooh, that was a lot of buzzy. But okay, the definition of reaction is showing a response to a stimulus. A more basic definition of that is acting in response to a situation rather than creating or controlling it. For example, a reaction is like, say somebody hits your pressure point you react immediately, right? It might tickle, it might hurt, you're gonna react right away. When you're doing, when you're more of a proactive person, or let's say you're more of a responsive person, I'm gonna look up responsive right now and tell y'all definition. If you're proactive, if you're a proactive person or responsive, responsive implies thoughtful action that considers long and short term outcome in the context of the situation at hand. Reactive behavior is immediate and without conscious thought, like a knee jerk response. That's why I was just saying, reactive behavior is immediate without conscious thought. If you're more of a responsive person, then you imply thoughtful action like you consider the short term and long term of the situation. Instead of reacting right away without thoughtfulness behind it, a proactive person would rather think of ways to control the situation or to create a controlling point in the situation. They rather take advantage of the things that they can control instead of focus on the things that they can't control. For example, the weather is bad one day, right? 
and it's rainy outside. A reactive person is going to react to the weather without thought. They're not going to be aware of how they can control. They have the ability to respond to the weather however they want to. A reactive person might respond to the weather a gloomy day by saying, okay, since it's gloomy outside, I'm going to be gloomy today. This is my reaction to gloomy weather. I can't control whether I'm energized on a gloomy day. A proactive person is going to figure out how they can control their re reaction, not reaction, their response to gloomy weather. They're going to figure out how they can create a controlling point in gloomy weather. Like they might exercise more in gloomy weather to keep them at the state that they enjoy being at. Someone may be strong enough to still be the same in a sunny day. Well, okay, in more simple words, not strong enough because everyone is strong in a different way. But some people have the ability to be more proactive. And I believe that you have the ability to apply more thoughts or to think more before you speak, to think more before you commit an action, to think more before you you say something because words are actually powerful. But uh, I hope y'all was able to gain a bit of knowledge between reactive and proactive. I'm gonna say it again, reactive person is immediate. They don't apply thought to their actions, feelings. They just react. They respond right away without considering how that might affect the relationship between that person and that other person. They're not putting thought to how this might affect short-term and long-term with this person, I should say, or even their self. Like, okay, the last thing I wanna say, officially, I think that we all slip up and we're bound to react sometimes. I think that we're all able to also be proactive and responsive with thought and actually consider high, actually have high concern for self and high concern for others. That's what being proactive is in a sense, because you're, you have high concern for what you want to do. So you're going to figure out how you're going to get what you want, what you want. A reactive person is just going to magnify the parts that they can't control and react with anger, or sadness, and it's okay to feel through your emotions, but also be proactive and take control of your situation. But LV is so random. I hope y'all like this video. If it sounds like a lot of nonsense, I can understand why you would say that. This video is very random. I'm random. All my videos is random. Uh, y'all have a good day. You having a bad day? Your day gonna flip good. All storms are temporary. Peace.